Temporary patchwork on the doors and walls at a Medford pizza restaurant and at the Republican headquarters for Jackson County. This after a burglar left behind quite a mess and he even made it into the house with the owners sleeping inside. NBC 5's Roma Villa Vicencio joins us live at this hour from the 300 block of East Main Street in downtown Medford where it all happened tonight. Roma. Art, the man tried to break into the Jackson Creek Pizza Company. As you can see, it's boarded up here. He was unsuccessful here. Then he made his way over to that roof where, like you mentioned, he ended up in someone's patio and broke into their house while they were sleeping. It was very scary. We felt very violated afterwards, like they say. In their 40 years of living in the heart of downtown Medford, Carol Phelps says she and her husband never imagined what they woke up to yesterday morning. We didn't realize what was going on until we searched it out and discovered that a young man had come into our area. Medford police say Jeremiah Hiscock went on quite the burglary adventure Monday morning. He tried to break into the Jackson Creek Pizza Company, was unsuccessful there, and then made his way over to the Jackson County Republicans office, which Phelps also owns. Medford police say Hiscock got onto the roof of the Republican building here and broke the skylight there. He used hose to get down into the building and then he was stuck. He couldn't get out of the building. So he used this chair. As you can see, it's broken because he used it to crack this glass and get out of the building. Phelps says it was just before that that his cock entered her home through her patio that faces the Middleford Alley. He came downstairs and here he was running around and acting very wild. He, he smashed out the big door over there the window. Phelps says she is feeling thankful nobody was hurt but is now left to pay the price of someone else's actions. Several thousand dollars because the huge skylight uh, they were trying to find the safety glass. I don't know if that's even going to be available. His cock did take some of Phelps' husband's gift cards, money, and keys, but Medford police did arrest him outside of the Jackson County Republican's office, and they did retrieve all of those things. He is facing several charges, including four counts of burglary. Live in Medford, Roma Villavicencio, NBC5 News.